Hello and welcome back to the Basement Card Collector. I collect many things. I collect players and sets and TTMs and uh, starting lineup figures, lots of things. I also enjoy going to antique stores. My wife and I, we love going to these garage sales, estate sales. Well, today's video is going to be a set showing of 1986 Topps football. Went to, a, went to an antique store and I found a couple binders on a shelf and actually I bought two binders, two sets that day. This video will just be showing the 1986 tops. And it's the green top set from way back. This actually is a Roger Craig that I sent TTM and I got back. And we also have um, a Dan Fouts from the same set. So I have two cards signed that are just extra and today I would like to show you the set that I bought. And at the end of this video, I will tell you how much I bought it for. And it really, um, I think you're going to be impressed by the price. So let's take a look. 1986 Tops. Uh, this would be the year that the Bears were the Super Bowl champs. They beat down the Patriots 46 to 10. Just like most Tops, record breakers start this set off. There's the Walter Payton. But the Bears team set right here, there's there's uh, Jim McMahon, Walter Payton, there's the Fridge. That Patriot team, this is pre-Tom Brady, believe it or not, folks. At one point, Tom Brady was not in the Super Bowl with the Patriots. Here's a Dan Marino, an early Dan Marino. Uh, Howie Long, 1986, obviously. There's an early Eric Dickerson. These are the cards are in excellent shape, and they're put in here by teams, so it makes it nice, to, nice to sort. If you're looking, look at that young John Elway. Not a rookie card, but it's a 1986. That's that's early in the career. My son's favorite Dallas Cowboys. Randy White was still there. Too Tall Jones into a Phil Sims 1986 so Lawrence Taylor I mean some of the names you just don't hear today as often here come my favorite 49ers check this out Joe Montana there's that Roger Craig that we've TTM'd but I opened this binder thinking no way this card is actually in this binder look at this Jerry Rice rookie card really great shape it's probably been in the sleeve since 1986 but that Rice um, a great iconic card, the green stripes to the side. So I was shocked to see that was here. There's an early Ronnie Lott. The Redskins were stacked just before they went on to win some of their own Super Bowls coming up. Bernie Kosar. Steve Largent. Just big names, Ozzie Newsome. It's a great looking set. I'm actually trying to collect a second version of it, like a second edition of it for my own collection. But I just happened to see it that day. Uh, here's the Dan Fouts. We have TTM right here. But I'd like to show you a couple more players here. I also have a Billy Sims signed 86 tops. Ooh, here we go. Now we're getting closer. Look, there's Reggie White. This is post Terry Bradshaw Steelers, but they're coming down off the uh, 70s high of winning all those Super Bowls. There's one more cool card, and if you know anything about the 86 tops, I opened up to two teams. Once I saw they were sorted by teams, I went and looked for the Jerry Rice rookie card. And there's a Warren Moon 86, and the cards are in very great shape if this video is showing the condition of the cards. They're in really smooth, very sharp corners. This was the second card I looked for right away. Boom. Steve Young, rookie card. Also in great shape, just setting in the middle. I couldn't believe it. And one more pretty decent card coming in here, right? Right here. I think they're two rookies right back to back. There's Andre Reed, Bruce Smith, and they're both rookie cards, 1986 tops. So when I saw this binder on the shelf, I thought, man, that's got to be out of my price range. But when I looked at the sticker, I'm going to just flip it to you and show you on the binder here. Look at the price tag that was on this set. 
$12.95. I have left it in the binder. I haven't moved any parts. Um, but for $13, I took this guy home. And actually another set that I'm going to show you in a separate video. Um, but again, the same price. So it was a super, a home run find at the local antique store. This has been... Oh, back a ways now, but I looked right away. 86 tops. My first thought is the rice in there. Boom. Is the Steve Young in there? And then once I saw the sticker on the side, it's like I'm taking this thing home. And uh, looking back, I wish I would have bought the second one. He also had an 81 tops football set. I just didn't have that kind of uh, cash in my wallet that day. So this will conclude my uh, antique store find video, but uh, I do about a video or two a week. If you're into um, sets or TTMs or player collections, um, you can subscribe to my channel and I will keep making the videos and I hope you watch. And if you stuck with me so far, thank you and um, we'll see you next time.